What's going on, man? Fast. Oh, yeah, man. It rips. <laughs> I don't know how fast it's going. I figure it's like, probably over 60 or something like you that. You think so? Yeah. <laughs> Blew that tire. Oh. Yeah, it blew on me. <laughs> this thing loves tires, man. Oh, the front one, yeah. There you go. Right there. So you, you modified it and stuff like yeah. that? Yeah. Yeah, so it's, it's got yeah, quite a bit of power. Wild. What's going on guys? Joe with OMGRC here. A big shout out to JTRC and also Damon. He's a customer. He's a subscriber. He's a good guy. And uh, he's going through a rough time and stuff like that, but I want to shout his name out there. Just let him know that I am thinking about you, man, and hopefully you're doing okay. And hopefully you can get back out and you know get into driving your RC vehicles. Um, but my buddy JTRC, if you don't know who he is, you definitely want to check him out on YouTube as well. Uh, he's a good he's a good guy man so uh, he's helped me out quite a bit he's always looking out for me so I definitely appreciate him and his support uh, also we, we do sell t-shirts and stuff like that too and actually JT's kind of helped me with that part of it so uh, I have it if you go to our website omgrc.com and if you just go pretty much it's under the merch so if you just merchandise and you just scroll down just a little bit there'll be shirts and you can pick different colors and all that good stuff so anyway if you want to support the channel pick you up a shirt or something like that or just buy something it's all good I mean buying an RC car hey man that's great support as well that's what I definitely get more money off of that um, as far as this camera here some of you guys are like how do you get that you know the speed on there it's just the GoPro Hero 7 black and in the application you can overlay the speed uh, the map g-force and all that good stuff on there uh, yeah so it's pretty cool I like it and I like the image stabilization that's on there because I had the GoPro Hero 7 oh sorry the, the GoPro Hero 4 silver it didn't have image stabilization and it made everything shaky and that's why I never really used it because I was like okay I'm done with this thing I never really used the GoPro to its full potential and I probably haven't used it but I've used a little bit more definitely use this one a lot more because I try to try to film in a recording most of the time Sorry, when I say film, it feels like really outdated. <laughs> so I don't. Um, 
I don't do film anymore. Uh, it did get a little scratch that's here because of the fact that it didn't have reverse or it wouldn't go in reverse for whatever reason. And so I had to rub up on the actual side of the curb to get this thing flipped around before a car came and ran it over. So that's had a little sacrifice there, but it's all good. 6S system that's in here, hobby wing system, uh, blown out tire. She loves to eat tires. These tires were already pretty much, well, they were out there last. Yeah, they were pretty much destroyed after like the second run. Uh, they're not a thick tire. They're the ones that come with stock on the on the car. I like I like them that like that five star, all that good stuff on there. But uh, the tires that they use are just way too thin. Like they really skimped on the actual rubber of them, and so they they and because it's a pretty heavy vehicle, at least it is now. And I'm gonna say this thing. I mean it's it's definitely it's a ten it's a ten pounder, if not like maybe twelve or something like that pounds. I would say around there. Yeah, so it, you know it's a lot of weight on the ground, so it's gonna you know it's gonna chew tires up. So if these tires were on something a little bit lighter, tires would last for a while, but not on this one, because especially when I get it all sideways, because that's like my love. I love getting this car sideways like that. It's just awesome, and so it's gonna chew tires up like crazy. But I, you know what? It's just I, this is my favorite. This is my favorite car for sure. I absolutely love this vehicle. I love this chassis layout and everything like that. It just handles really well. It's a good performer. I like it. Lunum shocks that are on. Does it have, no, it doesn't have. It's got plastic shocks. Anyway, it doesn't matter because it just handles good. So I'm, I'm all good with it. Now, I've made the chassis a little bit more kind of leans all over the place a little bit more just to kind of make it feel like a little bit more realistic. I like this. To, I like that. It's kind of like a sloppy setup a little bit where it's got a lot of bounce to it. Not so much. It's just got It's soft. It's made the, the vehicle soft. Even though, yeah, they're all like pretty much down to the as far as they can go uh, but I just have the ride height set you know higher up and these are just Gen Zay's 5000 milliamp 50c discharge packs a mighty punch on that part of it and because I'm recording this before I actually know how fast this car is going when I ran it down uh, one of the roads uh, I don't know how I probably I'm gonna guess it's probably went around like 50 something miles now I didn't really push it all the way I didn't give it full throttle so if you guys are wondering like oh is that as fast as it can go no and it's not even geared up all the way where I would want it to, so it'd make it go even faster, you know, because this thing would probably go like 80 something miles an hour, which is pretty good. I mean, for it's a pretty heavy vehicle. And I don't really I don't really care to go, you know, I'm not looking to break any records with it or anything like that. But uh, it's just a good car overall. Anyway, that's my insight. That's my uh, shout outs to you guys out there and everybody else that subscribed. Appreciate it. You guys leaving those comments. You guys are awesome. And we're getting closer and closer every day, man. Uh, rocking those, you know, subscribers, and I definitely appreciate it. And hopefully, I'm giving you, delivering you guys some good content. And I want to make it. I'm trying to make it better all the time, but it's sometimes it's a little bit difficult. Um, why? Uh, just the locations. So I, there, I got some ideas, but sometimes I need a second person, and that other person's not there, and I don't want to do anything stupid. Er. <laughs> so anyway, until next time, this is Joe with OMGRC. Thank you for watching. Until next time, later.